Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. It's Barcelona. They take on Villarreal and it's next on EA TV. Well, this wonderful city offers the visitors so much, including football. Barcelona, of course. I'm Derek Ray, and sharing commentary with me, as usual, is Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Spanish top flight, La Liga. It's Barcelona versus Villarreal. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Mark and Peter Stegen starts and go. Ilkay Gundogan plays alongside Frankie de Jong in the centre of midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Robert Lewandowski. And here's a look at the starting 11 for Villarreal. Well, for a while, everybody played with a 4 4 2. And it can still be a very good system. But it does rely very much on your front two getting the better of their markers and the wide midfield players being good in 1v1 situations. Let's hope they play it well today. And now they get the ball rolling. Parejo. Raul Albiol. Morales. Options in the centre. That's well blocked. That's a very fine piece of tackling. Well, technically offside, but not by a lot. Lewandowski. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players, he can go past people with ease, and he's got a great shot on him as well. I'm really looking forward to watching him play today. Pedraza. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Morales. Happy to take on the shot. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Frankie de Jong, Abe, promising move from Barcelona, a goal in the early stages, precisely what they had been planning. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. And 
the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Jeremy. Well, on you go, says the referee. Advantage. This could square the game. Rifled against the post, but back in play. And a touch off the defender, last of all. So a corner. Well, the referee letting them continue, but now it's going to be a booking. Well, he tried to play the advantage, but he was always going to come back to that challenge. Trying to pick out a teammate. Not all that convincing defensively. Pavejo. It might still be problematic. Well, no damage done. Foul there. Free kick awarded. Well, he might have been tempted to caution him, but didn't, Stuart. Yeah, and I like that from the referee. It's not a yellow card for me. Firing it towards goal! Well, the free kick, lacking just a little bit of guile. Well, spot on with that challenge. Ronald Araujo. Jules Koundé on the ball. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Will he find the net? And the keeper throws himself at the ball. Well, opting for the short corner. And thwarted there, following the cross. Fired over by Usman Dembele. And support available. Can he put it in? Oh, a stellar piece of defending. might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity but nothing comes of it Pedri Dembele on the ball Hiroki Abe Alonso and after the cross a tremendous block a cross lacking guile and accuracy Morales. Foyt. Jeremy. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Abe. Morales. Capu now. He's in behind. Well, the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger. Well, the threat was very real. Marvellous defending. Well, what a good piece of goalkeeping that was. But the equaliser can't be long in coming, surely. Yes, they just have to make sure they stay defensive. And it's in! A goal for Barcelona! They are the team in charge. Let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. But the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. So 
And back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Parejo. Very quick thinking there. But it's all going rather swimmingly for Barcelona as we near the half-time interval. Stuart, your thoughts? Yeah, they're playing really well here. They've controlled the flow of the game, they've won their individual battles, and they've created numerous chances. Their only problem in the second half could be complacency, but I can't see that happening. Moving the ball forward with purpose. Well, in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Well, the first 45 minutes have come and gone here in Catalonia. And I think it's fair to say he's had happier days in front of goal, Stuart. Well, as you can see, he just hasn't had enough touches in the key areas. And that's one of the reasons they're losing this game at the moment. So the ball is rolling again. Barcelona having already made a big first half statement here. Is there to be a response in the second 45? cross not quite imaginative enough and cleared away over the byline and a corner kick to come but he's gone short with it a fine block Given away by Barca. Good looking pass. Gundogan. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Here it is now, a substitution. Giovanni Lo Celso and here's Gerard Moreno definitely look as though they want to make this move count wonderful chance and oh it's in we cannot declare this contest over they still believe well here's the replay and what a well delivered cross this is perfectly placed and he does well to read the flight of the ball to be fair almost just cushions it beyond the goalkeeper and that seemed to catch him off guard a really good controlled finish so there we have it 2-1 Jackson on the ball. Capu now. Moreno. Magnificent defending. He's got to score! Well, the goal was at his mercy. Well, it certainly was. He has to score there. Jackson on the ball. Well, going for power and so close to finding the net.
my goodness, that save, fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. One goal down, but now a corner kick. Trying to deliver it accurately. Not messing around with that clearance. And they're sitting ever deeper. Jackson on the ball. A very timely interception. As the stat shows, Barcelona have had less of the ball, but their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. Rafinha. It's with Gundogan. Well, no stopping him. That's well blocked. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Short corner taken. The high press was very much on. Jackson on the ball. Going well. But nothing comes of it. Frankie de Jong. This could level it. Oh, but the keeper with an important save. How important is that? Well, he should score from there. That's a wasted opportunity. He should beat the keeper from that sort of distance. They favoured a short one here. Laid into the centre. But goalkeeper's ball, disappointingly for them. Marcos Alonso. Here's Rafinha. Depay. Can't miss, surely. And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form. Here's the replay, and I have to say, the keeper's got his angles all wrong there. That's a poor piece of goalkeeping. So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? Etienne Capou. Wonderfully weighted pass. It comes to absolutely nothing. Well, he made sure there was absolutely no way through. Gundogan. Kessier has it. Alonso. Now with Depay. Will he find the net? Brought by Raul Albiol. Fancy a short one. And a bit short with the clearance. And a fine stop. Well, pressure building. Another corner.
Fired over by Usman Dembele. Taking care of business defensively here. And tidily played. A delivery from Dembele. Well, they can keep possession now. And providing width. Will he finish? Not finished yet. Not quite yet. Still excitement left in the game. Well, here's the replay. And just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And what a clever bit of play it is from Moreno, both with his movement and his finish. That's a nice goal. And the ball is moving again. 3-2. Five minutes left. And that'll be a Barcelona ball. Far from a good pass. Can they fashion something? They need a goal. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Pedri Marcos Alonso Pedri Depay Well the pass not finding its target A danger here as he runs at them Slipshod passing Marcos Alonso Kessier has it. The pie. Well, that's a great advantage to any side when you're as comfortable on the ball as they are. Crossing opportunity. He's got to score! And a fine stop to turn the ball away. And well, that'll be a Barca throw. Pedri. And that is that very satisfying from the Barca point of view. A victory here. What did you think of their overall display? Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today. But overall, they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. Well, as is often the case, Usman Dembele was a real handful for opponents. Interested to know how you would sum up his contribution. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.